Okay, so what I just realized when we're looking at it and it was giving me those two random numbers instead of saying hallway and main bedroom, even though we selected that, I don't know why it was doing that. But if you click, for example, anywhere where it says basement, it's going to open up this. So if one of them is giving you a number, even though you set it up as, say, hallway, click on the one that says hallway. And then at the top right there next to it where it says hallway, you see that like square with the pen. You hit that and then you can set what you want. Close it and save it. Now, right now it's telling you below what we have connected, which is those two devices. Um, now, another thing that I saw is if I go into Wi-Fi settings... Actually, before that, you see where it says hallway and says two, basement says zero, main bedroom says zero. That means in the hallway, the two devices are connected on the hallway one. Nothing's connected in the basement, nothing's connected in the main bedroom. Um, so if we click Wi-Fi settings, here it tells you this is our 2.4 and 5 gigahertz network. And then below it says 6 gigahertz. Now, if you see, it says dedicated backhaul. And what that means, it will only be used for getting the best connection between each mesh mode. It will not be available for the Wi-Fi. But if we click on that, now we can put Wi-Fi network and backhaul. So only Wi-Fi 6E compatible devices can search for and join the network, which is what we want to enable the new feature. If you don't enable that, then you're not really going to get the 6E because it's not enabled, right, on your compatible device. Now we're going to hit save. And the password is going to be the same. It's just going to say Jev new 6 gigahertz. Uh, and the security is going to be WPA3 instead of these, which are WPA2, as you can see.